10 Types of People You Should Never Trust Have you ever placed your trust in someone you shouldn't have? Have you ever been fooled by someone close to you? Have you ever been stabbed in the back by someone you care about? Or made you question whether you could even trust them? Any connection, whether being between neighbors, partners, or friends, is built on trust. If that basis is weak, the relationship will eventually crumble. When this happens, we get enraged with the other person, but much more so with ourselves for not recognizing the warning signs sooner. If you keep an eye out for the following sorts of people and keep a safe distance from them, you can avoid walking down this road again. 1. People who are too nice Some people are inherently nice and kind. Then, there are individuals that appear to be overly friendly when they aren't. They usually only want something from you. These folks seldom provide personal information and spend the majority of their time asking far too many personal questions. Generally, some people are naturally interested, but you'll be able to tell the difference between someone who is trying to learn about you and someone who is just seeking information. Also, be aware of someone who is normally harsh but is suddenly pleasant to you. When they're dismissive and unpleasant to others but very polite to you, that's a red flag. 2. Secret Spreading People Do you have a gossipy friend? Is it common for them to gossip behind their backs about other people, or simply for fun spreading rumors? People like these should be avoided. They've already demonstrated that they're not afraid to violate people's privacy and spread their secrets. Even if you consider them a friend and they swear not to tell anybody else, you can't trust them since they've already betrayed your trust with so many other people. They talk in order to earn favor with others, to feel important and in charge, and to create unnecessary drama for the sake of it. 3. People who are constantly in need Everyone has basic requirements in life. This is perfectly natural, but there is a toxic personality type that is always loud about what they require from you and the rest of the world. They usually begin subtly, asking for a dollar or assistance with a job that they are supposed to be handling. This can happen for a variety of reasons, but if you find someone doing it on a regular basis, it's better to create some distance between you and them. Everyone needs assistance at times, but you must also attend to your own needs. You cannot devote all of your time to meeting the needs of others. 4. People who lack compassion and self-awareness Empathy is the ability to understand or feel what another person is going through from their perspective or to put oneself in their shoes. The ability to identify one's own feelings and emotions is known as self-awareness. It also relates to being aware of the feelings, needs, intentions, and responses of others. Never put your trust in someone who lacks empathy or self-awareness. These are the folks that are generally good at deceiving you, manipulating you, and making you feel awful about yourself afterward. These people are frequently narcissists, psychopaths, or sociopaths. They may be completely unaware of their condition or how it affects their life choices. Listening to what they say and studying their conduct in specific settings might help you identify these folks. If they enjoy making fun of others in a mean-spirited or offensive way, feel good when someone else is abused or humiliated, don't care about other people's feelings or safety when they argue, and never say sorry for anything no matter what they do wrong and or are unaware of their flaws, they may lack empathy. Furthermore, some persons with this condition are so self-absorbed that they cannot recognize any flaws in their behavior. 5. Fickle-Minded Individuals People whose moods fluctuate as much as the weather do not make good friends or lovers. If their emotional condition changes too much, they may make promises to you just to break them the next day. They lack confidence in their choices and are readily swayed by rumors and gossip. That's not to suggest that individuals can't change their thoughts, but this type of person has a tendency of breaking their promises, which makes it difficult to trust them or have a solid connection with them. 6. Overly Competitive Individuals Competition might be beneficial. You may learn from it and set goals for yourself to improve. This, however, does not apply to every aspect of your life. Some individuals turn everything into a competition. If you got a new car, they're probably going to buy one as well. 
If you've recently gone on a vacation, they're about to go as well. If you have started a new diet plan, they also have started it a week ago. If you ran one mile today, they very certainly ran two. You understand what I mean. They are continuously trying to outdo you out of jealousy or insecurity or both. These people will always try to downplay your achievements, causing emotions of fear, ineptitude, or anguish in you. You begin to doubt yourself or believe that you simply do not measure up. 7. The Unending Victim some unhappy folk appear to be under continual attack in every facet of their existence. At first, it's easy to feel sorry for them. Some people truly do get the short end of the stick in life and your assistance may make a difference, but keep an eye out for the forever victim. These are the folks that frequently complain about everything going wrong for them and you'll note that the most consistent feature in every story is a poor decision they made. These people are emotionally taxing and it's better to avoid them after you've noticed their patterns. 8. Control Freaks It's a red flag if someone is continually attempting to control every scenario. People like this frequently want to obtain control by engaging in a power game. They may speak with you in order to learn about your flaws and emotional triggers in order to take advantage of them. They're more concerned with your flaws and negative experiences than with your life because controlling individuals aren't interested in developing connections. They see life as a game of chess and they believe that if they aren't calculating every minute, they will lose. Such people will never be trusted since they are too self-centered. 9. Manipulators Manipulators are the most frequent toxic personality type and they can be difficult to recognize at times. They usually go out of their way to persuade you that they are your closest friend, but as you get to know them more, you see that the more they discover about you, the more it appears that you're doing things for them that you would not ordinarily do. A person who constantly brings up elements of your personality that you are uncomfortable with or who uses the personal information you've revealed to persuade you to go their way is one warning sign. 10. People who refuse to accept no as an answer. If you've ever encountered someone who doesn't grasp that no means no, you should be cautious. This type of person can be stubborn and powerful, yet they can also be quite cunning and charming. They will attempt to persuade you to agree with them or do what they want, so beware. They may appear to be caring and sensitive right now, but it's only because they want something from you. They only care about you if you are useful to them, so don't be shocked if they change their colors as soon as you say no. Nothing was ever genuine in the first place. While encounters are unavoidable at times, identifying a poisonous personality allows you to keep them at far. It is possible to cultivate a social circle that supports your successes and it may make a huge impact on your life. It's time to make some adjustments now that you know what to look for. You will be glad you did. So, while you read this list, did anyone in particular spring to your mind? Have you ever encountered any of these 10 sorts of untrustworthy people? Let us know in the comments. Well, that's all for today from Brainy Facts. If you enjoyed, give it a thumbs up and do not forget to subscribe if you don't want to miss our next interesting social psychology video. Thanks for watching.